Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Hermit Craft Season 3 Amplified. <laughs> Aw, yeah. And so I'm over here at the island, or well, this little peninsula guy here. It's uh, kind of about to turn into an island, at least this half of it. Now you can see I dug out this little thing here. This is not a chunk error. <laughs> Although it kind of looks like a chunk error. Uh, yeah, it's not a chunk error. Um... I think what I'm going to try to build, I don't know how successful I'm going to be, uh, but I think I'm going to try to build a dry dock. Uh, if you're not familiar with what a dry dock is, uh, it is a dock that they, like, it's an area that can be flooded uh, to bring ships in and then drained uh, to be able to work on the ships, like on the underside of the ships and stuff like that. Uh, and I think what I'm going to do is I think I'm actually going to flatten this side out right there. I'm going to take all that, that off and make it even with this part here. Or maybe, yeah, just above the water. Yeah, make it even with this part here. Uh, and then I I want to try to put some kind of crane or something, maybe at like the, toward this end of it, like maybe over here somewhere. Uh, something that, like, like a big crane. Um... I think like a big, I mean, I don't know how it's going to work. <laughs> I, I like, I have no clue how it's going to work or look like I've never built a crane before, uh, but I need some way or, you know, the people need some way of getting the, the ship from here, uh, maybe to over here, you know, like say maybe another ship needs to come in emergency kind of thing. They can grab the one out of there, stick it over here. And then the other one can come in and they you know, that kind of thing. Uh, but I just went and grabbed the beacons uh, from over there, and I need to set them up. Uh, I dug all that out by you know by hand without any, without any boost, and uh, it was slow. <laughs> so I'm gonna set up the beacons, uh, get a little bit more of this dug out, uh, namely this like top portion of this guy, and then yeah. Uh, so once I make some progress, I will uh, I'll come back and show you what's going on. Alrighty, uh, so I've got a big hole. <laughs> Uh, it's kind of shaped like the bottom of a boat, a little bit. I, I did look up dry docks just to see, you know, basically what they were looking at. Uh, some of them were completely flat on the bottom, and then they had, like, these things that would come up um, to, like, support the bottom of the boat. Uh, that was a bit too much. <laughs> like, I I'm not even, like, I guess pistons. And, eh. I like this better. Uh, it's, it's basically in such a way that, uh, you know, it it'll handle smaller boats but it also handle bigger boats um and i i do plan to like maybe put a boat in here at some point and uh, that's not going to be it's probably not going to be today um i think what i want to do is figure out or work out like i did a little bit of planning in oh no that's too many a little bit of planning in creative i don't need those freaking arrows <laughs> all right uh, so we need some of that. There we go. All right, so we're going to put some walls or some, some gates in here. And I'm thinking one's going to go right about here. And it's going to come all the way down to the bottom like that and all the way through like that. Yeah, that's a big gate. <laughs> all right, so the way this gate's actually going to work is or at least I'm, the way i'm saying it's gonna it's not actually gonna work um yeah it's just like and there's no way there's no way uh, so what we're gonna do is i actually shouldn't have tore all that out <laughs> dang it i don't need all that torn out it just needs to look like it was all torn out all right so the way we're gonna do this is we're gonna have this guy coming along here along the bottom so this is part of the door and then the upper part of the door is going to go right about there. I'm thinking I want it just... Well, no, that's like directly even with the... I'm kind of thinking I want the door, the top of the door, just above uh, the water line. Like that. Right. All right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take this stuff out of here. Like so. And how are we going to do this? I think this part is going to like be gone pretty much. And then the bulk of the door is actually going to be andesite. 
Um, it looks, it, I mean, it kind of looks like, oh, that, that really blends in though. Maybe we'll use polished andesite. See how that does. Let's see, polished andesite. Ugh. Be a thing. Okay. Let's see here. So if we bring this across, all right. Yeah, that does look better. Yeah. All right. So it's going to go like that. There we go. I just want it to look like there's a, a door here. <laughs> Some kind of gate type apparatus, I guess you could say. Um, and then right in here, we're going to have some stone brick because, I mean, stone brick is structural, I guess. So that'll go down like that. We'll go ahead and... Actually, no, we're not going to put it... Oh, my. <laughs> we're not going to put it back there. Uh, let's see. Let's fill that in. Very nice. And then uh, we're going to put some of these right here. Like, and this is like the guide kind of thing that like makes sure the, the, the gate is going in a straight line, I guess you could say. Uh, it's not going to come out any further uh, than what it is. And then we're going to have some more uh, over here. Uh, I tore out too much. <laughs> I hate it when I do that. Okay. And then over here, we're going to do it again. This is going to flood. But that's fine. Uh, stone brick, right like that, and then yeah, that's gonna flood too. <laughs> Everything's flooding. No. All right, and then I guess that actually has to come up more than yeah. Break. Thank you. Something like that, and then we're gonna have some more of these. Uh, coming up this again, it's it's like, you know, it's a guide to make sure that everything lines up and goes where it's supposed to go. So then the gate is would like be pushed across by some kind of mechanism back in there. Uh, it gets pushed across that way, blocks the water off. This place gets drained and then the boat like slowly settles toward the bottom and then rests on the bottom. That's the idea. <laughs> I don't know if it actually looks like that, uh, but that that is uh, the idea. So we'll do that because we don't need that there. I was I was initially thinking about trying to have it to where two doors, where it looked like it was two doors, and that they you know like swung open, but that would be just like nearly impossible to to like close. Like even like in real life, I I know there's some that do it that way, but it just it just seems like it would be easier just to like push a door <laughs> across. I guess I don't I don't know. Oh, you know what we could actually do is put some of these down here just as extra extra guides, so to say. Yeah, there we go. All right, uh, let's fill that in. I need to turn this water off. Go away. Thank you. And then, yeah, so it gets pushed across, gets pushed into this slot here. And oh, I just I just filled that in. What am I doing? All right, uh, we need that. Oh, I don't want no freaking ink sack. And I could probably outline this with stone brick or something just to make it more obvious what's happening. <laughs> it's not easy to make things like this obvious. Um, if it was, if I was leaving it open, then it would probably, no, then it would probably be obvious or at least more obvious. Get this in here. Boom and boom. All right, so I'm kind of thinking we could get rid of this. And we'll probably want to put something over here like that so that it looks like it's been pushed through. 
like that. All right, and then we can hop over here, do basically the same thing here. So we will need some brick. There we go. Aha. And then we could probably do something like, uh! <laughs> dang it. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Let me out. Let me out. I want out. Please let me. Okay. <laughs> ha. And then if we step back, how she do? I think that looks like a gate like that. I mean, it looks like a wall that would like, be pushed. <laughs> Wait, why is that? Why is that so high? Oh, the, okay, yeah, that's. Hmm. Wonder if it would be better just to leave it open back here a little bit, you know? Like just leave some space above the the door there, so that it looks like it goes deeper than it actually does. Something like that, maybe. Hmm. I don't think it really... I mean, that's one of those things you'll probably never even notice. <laughs> yeah, I think I think that does what I, what I want it to do. I mean, it looks like a big gate. Uh, so what we will have to do, or what I'll have to do, uh, is flood this part here. Just so that, the, you know, it looks like the water... So that the water is up against this. Uh, I may just end up just filling in this top level and then, like, breaking out the... The filler blocks I want to do that yeah th that I think that looks better well this should be at the same height shouldn't they <laughs> ah this indecisiveness is too much all right so I you know you've got the you've got the basic idea of what I'm what I'm wanting here so how would it look if I did that and Yeah, we'll have to shore this up a bit, bulk it up, uh, give it some support looking stuff. We'll have to uh, get to build the other one over here. Uh, I think this one over here is going to go right where this line is right here. And then I've got, you can see I started clearing this out a little bit. I got to like round it off over there and then get it dug down to at least that. Well, not, not really. I get Well, yeah, I'm going to, <laughs> I'm going to, and then I got to do the same thing over here. This one is a bit well, no, that should be okay. Yeah. Anyway, uh, that's that's that. Uh, let me get to this one. Get some clearing out done. Get some prettying up done, and I shall return. Well, I, I got a little bit of little bit of work done. <laughs> like I was just doing and doing and doing, and not even thinking about like recording. And I was just doing. <laughs> uh, so I at first I I just had the logs down there in the bottom. I had the logs going across with the stairs uh, there and there, and then it's logs, as you can see, under there. And I was looking at it, I was like, you know, that looks okay, but I want it to look a little bit better. And so I was like, well, what if I stick some slabs on top? And I started with stone brick slabs, and like I placed a few, and I was like, no, <laughs> that's not going to look good. Uh, and then I was like, well, you know, I got a whole bunch of stone in that chest up there. So why not try some stone slabs? And I think it turned out pretty freaking amazing. I am so, so happy with how this whole thing uh, is turning out. Like, it looks like a dry dock. <laughs> like, I'm looking at it, and I'm like, man, that is a dry dock. <laughs> like, that, that literally is a dry dock. Um... I did uh, get it all cleaned out. This one, I've got a little bit more cleaning up to do, but you can see it's pretty well cleaned up. Uh, the other side is is a bit better, I think. Uh, I, I added some cobblestone over here, just trying to see, you know, how it looked and all that. I mean, it it's okay, I think. Uh, but I really do think that the the cob or the the stone brick there along the edge there makes it gives it that little extra something that makes it look like it's guided kind of thing, you know? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. All right, so what I want to do here is I want to I want to build a crane of some kind and I'm thinking thinking here. 
And the problem is, as you can see, this is an even numbered thing here. Uh, the shape of this is actually the shape that was here. Oh, oops. <laughs> uh, it's the natural shape. And then I just copied it over there. So, I mean, they were, they were pretty close already. I just had to place a few blocks over here and break a few blocks and it was perfect. Uh, so let's see, we're going to build a crane. How are we going to do this? I think it, it's going to need to be bigger, right? Oops. Uh, I don't know that it's going to be that big. Maybe, maybe, but I doubt it. And so that's three, four. And then what if we did something like this here? All right. So it's going to be an even numbered crane. Hopefully it turns out okay. Uh, let's see. So if we do something like this. Oh, no. <laughs> no. And like that. And then what if we do a little something like that? Boom. It doesn't have to be like a massive crane. Like you can see like not really that big of a boat can fit in here because it's 20 long. I don't even think the freighter or the, the thing we have over there can fit in here. Uh, and that's not necessarily a bad thing. So let's go maybe two, two above that one. Yeah, I think that, that looks all right. Like so. It's starting to, starting to look like something. <laughs> it's looking like something. And then I guess we could take something like this and do something like this. And then that should probably continue. Well, actually, this this is probably high enough, right? Like that should be high. Oh, dang. Um. I guess yeah. We'll just we'll just continue using these. I think is that what is? Oh, <laughs> that's quite. I kept seeing something out of the corner of my eye. I'm like, what the heck's going on over there? Just freaking squid. All right. So if we do something like that. Hmm. We'll have the way to get up here, maybe right there. We'll just have, oh, oh geez. <laughs> we'll just have some ladders or something coming up right there. And then, oh God, how are we going to do this? Um, let's see. If we do something, oh, that's not going to work. Um, all right, so if we bring some logs up like this, uh, uh, aha, something like that, right? Possibly. <laughs> so the, the the kind of crane I want to go for here uh, is one of those counterweight cranes so it, you know it has the long arm that's going to hang over that and then out the back uh, it's going to have a big counterweight back here and that way you know it, it uses the weight over here to help lift uh the boat yeah and i've decided like it's just dang it <laughs> uh we're just gonna lift the boat you know it's just gonna lift the boat to work on it um it's not gonna move it anywhere it's just gonna lift it uh, I don't know that that's the safest way to do it, but yeah, you know, who needs safety? All right, so I guess what we should do is we should get some planks of some kind. And let's go ahead and get rid of this corner piece just so we could pillar up a bit. All right? And how are we going to do this? Hmm. I kind of want it at an angle. So we're actually, I think we're going to need stairs. Do that. Say hello. Oh, Halfie. Halfie. <laughs> Howdy. Okay. Let's do that. Okay. And then what if, what if, what if, what if, what if, what if, what if. All right. So we come out like this at an angle. Oh, that's really long. That is a, I didn't realize how long that was. <laughs> uh, so what if we do two and then up? 
two up two up something like that and then this would be the arm i guess and we'll have to get underneath to add more oh well we can bring this down it's fine it doesn't have to be like a perfect thing like as long as it looks like what it's supposed to be then i think we're okay <laughs> i think we're okay all right so if it goes like that that looks like crap <laughs> That looks like absolute garbage. Oh well, I never claimed to be the best at building cranes. I've never built one before. Um, I'm thinking I've probably never build one again. <laughs> Oops. Um, actually, no. Is that? I think that's the one we want, isn't it? Let's get rid of that one. Cause then it'll be that one. Yeah, I think that's the one we want. So if we put some stairs under there and then we'll just pillar out this way and get rid of that one and that one and that one and then if we do dink 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 and then we hop down here we gather our blocks and uh. <laughs> uh. It looks so bad. It looks so bad. Uh, let me work this out and I'll be back. All right. Uh, so this is basically what I've come up with. I'm going to work some more on it. Like, um, I think I'm going to go over to a creative world and <laughs> take a look at it because this thing is looking pretty derpy. Um, I'm sure you can hear the bass. Uh, there's people. Yeah, it's, it's getting that time of night where they're starting to party. It's Friday. Can't really blame them, uh, but it does kind of put a damper on anything I'm trying to do. Uh, and it's going to be like this till God only knows when. So I'm going to have to to end it here. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but I think this part of it, I think, really turned out incredibly well, uh, as well as this part coming around here. I think it turned out really, really nice. Uh, there's a zombie over there. Die, zombie. No, I said die. No, I said oh, die. <laughs> Finally hit him. Jeez. Alrighty. Yeah, that's gonna, I mean, that's, that's it. That's all. <laughs> this is, <laughs> it looks so derpy. It looks like a, you know what it looks like? It looks like one of those, those back scrubbers that you get for the, the shower. <laughs> like that's the handle. And then that right there's the scrubber thing. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's too much. I don't know. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, that's it for me today. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the episode, and I will see you all next time.